we did it you guys 50 subscribers y'all yeah. know what that means right dance party you guys for 50 subscribers i'm so grateful for each and every single one of you i'm so grateful to be part of this now community this now community is so positive all i get is love in my comment section so i'm so grateful for each and every single one of you let's keep being positive towards each other let's uplift each other in this now community so yeah i'm grateful for you guys thanks for watching and i wanted to announce the winner really quick for the $50 Amazon gift card, which I said I would do a giveaway once I hit 50 subscribers. So the winner is... So go ahead and email me, girl, so I can get you your stuff. But yeah, without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so let's review what the kit comes with. Nail tips. Critical pusher. Nail file. Four in one base coat, fancy smancy rhinestones, and of course the little cute LED light. So I start off by pushing my cuticles back. Then I nip my cuticles. Then I'm removing the shine from the natural nail. Then I file my natural nail. And then at this point, I've already sized my tips. Now the instructions do say to add a base coat. So the first time I tried it with this kit, I used a base coat that my school gave me in the kit. But I used the base coat that came with the kit in this video this time. So then I used that 4-in-1 base gel that came with the kit and I just put that inside of the nail tip. And as you guys can see, as you put the nail tip on, the gel starts to disperse. And then we're just going to cure that. And that's what it looks like with the tips on. These nail tips have a really good shape to them. I'm just kind of trying to perfect that shape a little bit more. Now I just grab my e-file and I just try to get that tip as flush to my cuticle as I can. So the color that I'm using here is by Madame Glam. It's the pastel lilac color. It's their 3-in-1 gel polish. Every time I use this color, I just think how perfectly it looks like my nail rug that I have here. And I'm just like, my nails and this rug share the same bloodstream. They look so similar.
And this is what the nails look like after the first coat. And this is what they look like after the second coat. Okay, at this point I'm adding the Not Polish Gem Glue. And I'm gonna disperse this gem glue and then start applying the rhinestones. For my ring finger, I added Young Nails foil art to it. I used a transfer gel from Daily Charm. I also wanted to give this kind of like a rusted look or rustic look to the nail. So I didn't mind if it didn't like come off perfectly. After adding the foil nail art to the nail I just thought wow my nail and the rug share the same DNA now not just the same bloodstream
that's the final look you guys make sure to subscribe give me a thumbs up and comment i love to hear what you guys have to say have a wonderful day and as always thanks for watching